Welcome to the lesson Mixtures KCC 2006 Paper 2 Question Number 21. So let's go to the question. A solution whose volume is 80 liters is made up of 40% of water and 60% of alcohol. When X liters of water are added, the percentage of alcohol drops to 40%. A. Find the value of X. This is the first question. The second question is... Um, 30 liters of water is added to the new solution. Calculate the percentage of alcohol in the resulting solution. Then part C of the question is 5 liters of the solution in B is added to 2 liters of the original solution. Calculate in the simplest form the ratio of water to that of alcohol in the resulting solution. So let's go to the first part of the question. Where are we supposed to find the value of x liters that are added that is uh, x liters of water so we need to get the volume of water first since you're given the percentage volume of water is 40 over 100 times 80 which will give that two liters then we get the volume of alcohol which is uh, 60 percent uh, multiplied by 80 and that will give 48 liters so those are the volumes of water and alcohol in the original solution now what about when x liters of water is added so the volume of water added is x liters is um, given in the question so new volume of water therefore will be uh, 32 plus x that is the liters so that is the new volume so let's get the volume of alcohol. The volume of alcohol will not be affected. In this case, it will remain the same. It will just remain constant, which is um, 48 liters. That one is not affected. So it still be 48 liters. Now, from there, uh, we need to get the ratio of water to alcohol. So let's get the ratio of water to alcohol. That is um, after the drop, we are given after um, X liters are added, alcohol drops to 40%. So if alcohol drops to 40%, therefore water will be 60%. So water will be 60, then alcohol will drop to 40%. So that will be the new ratio, which when simplified will be 3 is to 2. So that is the simplified. Now, let us um, indicate now the liters of water, 32 plus x. That is the new solution of water, 32 plus x. So 32 plus x, that is the water volume. Then the volume of alcohol remains the same, so you not be changed. Now, using this uh, ratio, we can cross multiply and get the x liters that are added so we just need to cross multiply since we can see we're matching water to alcohol 3 is to 2 then 32 plus x ratio 48 so when we cross multiply uh, this is what you're going to get when you multiply cross multiply you get 3 multiplied by 48 is equivalent to 2 multiplied by 32 plus x. So this will be 32 two times. Let me just put the brackets. Indicate the brackets. 2 into brackets, 32 plus x. So that is a cross multiplication. So multiply this, get 144 is equals to 264 plus 2x. Uh, we saw for x, 2x is equal to 144, subtract 64, we get 80, so x is given by 40. So the volume of water added, that is x liters, is therefore 40. That is the first part of the question. Now part b, if that liters of water is added to the new solution, calculate the percentage of alcohol in the resulting solution. That liters of water is added to the new solution. Part b. So, if 30 liters of water is added to the new solution, therefore the volume of water 
now will be given by now uh, remember we have uh, the original so we have 40 plus 32 plus uh, 30 now 40 is the x liters that we've just calculated in the first part then we have uh, 32 liters of water that is the original solution and then another extra of 30 liters is added so the total volume of water will therefore be 102 when you add everything there the volume of alcohol still remains constant is not affected so it's still 48 now these two will give uh, the whole volume now of water plus alcohol will be given by so the total volume of water and alcohol will therefore be given by 102 plus 48 which will give 150 liters uh, that is the total volume now we need to get the percentage of alcohol in the resulting solution so to get the percentage of alcohol we just get the volume of alcohol which is uh, 48 in the resulting solution that is uh, 48 48 liters and the total is 150 and then you multiply by 100 that is simply how we're supposed to get the percentage of alcohol and uh, we get that on as that two percent therefore the remaining percentage is for water so that is the first the second part the third part of the question if five liters of the solution in b is added to two liters of the original solution Calculate in the simplest form the ratio of water to that of alcohol in the resulting solution. Now, in part B, we have already obtained the volume of alcohol. And um, in the original solution, you can see volume of water is given there. We calculated it in the first part. So, 5 liters of the solution in B. 5 liters of five liters of solution in B and then you have two liters of the original solution so we have uh, let us begin by calculating the volume of alcohol in these five liters in B uh, the volume of alcohol in five liters of this solution in B and we already know the percentage of alcohol in um, the second part, that is in part B, is that 2%. So it will be that 2% of 5 liters. So it will be that 2% of uh, 5 liters. And this will give 1.6 liters. That is uh, alcohol. So to get the volume of water, we just need to subtract. So if in 5 liters, 1.6 liters is um, alcohol. So the remaining from 5 liters will be water so to get the volume of water you just take uh, the total five subtract the volume of alcohol which is 1.6 and uh, the volume of water in uh, this resulting solution is 3.4 when you add 1.6 and 3.4 you get five liters now that is uh for the five liters of the solution now let's go to what about these two liters of the original solution Two liters of the original solution now in the original solution we need to know the percentage of water to that of alcohol in the original solution and that one is given in the first uh, part of the question so volume of alcohol in two liters of the original solution so what is the percentage of alcohol in the original solution that is given by it is here uh, in the first so 60 percent 60 percent in the original solution so we have to calculate that 60 percent which is 60 divided by 100 multiplied by 2 liters and that will give 1.2 that will give 1.2 liters again to get the volume of water is just the remaining the remaining from 2 liters you just need to get um, 2 liters subtract 1.2 so to get the volume of water in 2 liters of the solution will be given by we just need to get 2 subtract 
but it's the alcohol and this will give 0 0.8 so you, you realize that 0 0.8 plus 1.2 that will give 2 so those are the new volumes both in 5 liters and 2 liters now the question is uh, the ratio find the ratio of water to that of alcohol in the resulting solution so what we need to do here we need to get now the total volume of water to that of alcohol and get that ratio so we start by getting the volume of water let's get the volume of water and the volume of alcohol so to get the total volume of water we have um, 3.4 in 5 liters we have 3.4 then in 2 liters we have the volume of water is 0 0.8 so we add so 3.4 plus 0 0.8 then the volume of alcohol is the remaining in 5 liters 1.6 liters and then in 2 liters we have 0. Point, 0. Point, no it is 1.2 so 1.6 and 1.2 so now we need to get that ratio and simplify it so 3.4 plus 0. 0.8 we get 4.2 ratio 1.6 plus 1.2 we get this one is 2.2 like to simplify this, uh, we can remove the decimal and uh, this will be 42 ratio 28 by multiplying both uh, by 10. Now when you simplify this, uh, 42 divided by... Can divide this one by, uh, by 6, uh, by 7, you get 6. And then by 7, you get 4. When you simplify 6 is to 4, you get 3 is to 2. So, and that is the new ratio simplified. And that is how you're supposed to solve that question on mixtures.